Hello everyone, Sigmalator here. Welcome back to Silent Hill 3. Right. We know where we're going now, roughly. Uh, yep. Down here and to the right. Switch out that. Don't want to waste ammo. Oh, hello. So that's what's making it look. Seriously, guys. Oh, there was a door here. Alright, good. in the school. What's this? Go home, drop dead, thief. Hmm. This used to be a lesser's. I mean, this was my desk once upon a time. Alright, you weren't very popular with the other kids. Actually, notebook and point. Oops, there's a letter stuck in here too. Let's see. There's a girl named Alessa in my class. If your memory is any good, you may remember her She's the one I said they called a witch. Most likely her mother is abusing her. I've never seen her come in without some sort of scrape or bruise. But my, her expression is pitifully dark for a six-year-old. Something like this may not be so uncommon. Rather than coming up with pointless ideas, it's best just to watch and wait. But isn't there something I can do to help? I'm considering consulting a lawyer... I do have my reservations. That's why I thought I'd ask you, my friend, for your opinion first. Kay Gordon. Ooh, submachine gun bullets. Lovely. Right. Nothing else around here? Doesn't look like it. Ah, okay, that's how you that's how you avoid those. Oh god, camera. Can you please cooperate with me? There's a tape deck here, it's perfectly usable. Ah Do you know about what happened here seventeen years ago? You've been here a long time. You must have heard some details. A group of pagans, blinded by earthly desires, spit in the very face of God. They tried to use the seal of Metatron to prevent God's awakening. But God drove the unbelievers away and threw them into the abyss. But due to their wickedness God was unable to be born properly and so she has slumbered ever since in the womb of the Holy Mother until the time of the awakening that's all that I know that's it huh well thanks father Vincent I heard that the Holy Mother has been found. Is it true? Alessa has been found? Did Claudia say that? Yes. Then it must be true. Her sight rarely fails her. Bless the Lord. Maybe it's because of her great faith. But I could never be like her. I wouldn't want to. Nor I. The truth is, Sister Claudia... Frightens me a little. Well, now, let's both show our faith by forgetting about this little talk, okay? Yes, but 
Does that mean this land will finally be the home of eternal paradise? If God wills it, my sister. If God wills it. Right. Uh, what are these letters? No, maybe a bunch of suggestions. People are starting to voice their dissatisfaction about Father Vincent using the organization's money for his own personal benefit. I've also heard rumours that Father Vincent has been extorting donations from some followers. Is he really the right person for such a position? I'm in no place to deny all he's done to make the organisation grow. Even though we believe in God, if there were some sort of gathering, shouldn't we be valued not for our limited talents or our uh, talkativeness, but for the depth of our faith? L.S. Okay then. Health, thank you. Right, so Vincent is a priest in this screwed up religion. Well, thankfully, they're pretty weak. Really? This huge room and there's nothing in here? Alright then. There's one more door to check. High Priestess Tarot card. Excellent. Okay, so that's the fifth card. Name Claudia Wolf is written very small on the cover. Looks like this is her diary. Alright, let's have a look. November 10th. She, she didn't die then, she was born. I knew that for a fact. But then why haven't I found her yet? They were supposed to need her power to build paradise for the happiness of the people. She was supposed to be reborn for that. I'd really like to see her. November 14. Uh, read the Book of Praise. I want to thank Father for lending me such an invaluable book. I found what I'd been searching for in there. How to awaken God, but it's much too cruel. Will I be able to pull it off when I see her? November 16. I was free all day, so I read A Modern History of Refugees and Young Slaves Child Exploitation. I don't want to be a mere bystander in this world. I can't do anything now, though, and that's what's hard. All right, then. Or birthday card. So she was still hanging on to this. Happy birthday. To little Claudia, happy sixth birthday. I love you as if you were my real sister. Here's to you. All right, then. Out. Just a candle, okay. Right. Gonna avoid the big chungas. Oh, 
sod off. Right, okay. So now I need to head back to the lift and go back down to that room. Okay, and then left and then right. I just need to work out what order to put the cards in. Something's getting angry. Priestess, put you there. Right, okay, so they're not in the right position. So, have a look. Uh, the upside down man under the ground at the bottom. His right to his left, there's no one around. Leave him alone though, his tears are profound. The moon is up above the sky, full or crescent, floating high. Twinkling light sits like a crown on the head of a crazy clown. So that's the fool and the moon above him. Your Excellency praying to God most high. Do you, do you think you can tell me why you always look up at the sky? Eye of night, so maybe you go there. No. Okay then. All right, so apparently I have night there, my priestess there. Oh, I see. Nothing is supposed to be around the hanged man. I get it now. Ah, God. 
I probably could have figured that out. I'm an idiot. They go. We already knew that. God, what is this? I don't know if I was being chased again or not, but I was going to risk it. Hello, you two. What do I want? Well, for the two of you to die, that would be nice. Then I could relax. When did you stop believing in God? God lives. Just look around you. But I do believe in her. In my own way. I fear her, and I adore her. But I haven't lost my mind like you. You think that this is the work of God? Isn't this all nothing more than your own personal nightmare? Just like Alessa 17 years ago? If this really is the work of God, then I'd say she has lousy taste. You mock God? Traitor. You will go to hell. Not that again! think you are claiming to know God's will. Go home, Vincent. Home. This church is my home. I built it with my power. The power of money that you view with such scorn. Although, I admit that this atrocious scenery is all yours. Continue to get in my way. Did you kill me? Well, <laughs> well, the guest of honor has arrived. Let's get this party started. Heather, go ahead and kill this crazy bitch. This demon who claims to speak for God. The time has come. You can kill her now. You go to hell! Oh. Yeah, never turn your back on crazy people. What did you do? Oh, she stabbed him, Nothing clearly. Important. You're not going to run? I guess this is the end. No, the beginning. As Vincent said, the time has come. Alessa, I'm saddened that you didn't agree to this on your own. But I thank you for nurturing God with all the hate in your heart. It's time for mankind to be released from the shackles of sin which bind them. But a God born from hatred can never create a perfect paradise. Try to hate 
hasten the day of her arrival. Sacrifices were made. Those are my sins. If you feel so guilty about it, why don't you go to hell? Heather! Use the seal! Vincent? The seal of Metatron? Yep. Now your stupid dream is over! Oh, that's just a piece of junk. What do you think you can do with that? Do you really think it can kill God? I'm sorry to see you fell for my father's foolishness. What? You're pathetic. Shit. I'm not gonna get a bad ending again. I really am terrible at these games. <laughs> that here Vincent's dead all right so what am I actually doing Killing Claudia? What's going on here? Come this far, I can't turn away now. Okay. I didn't know what I was supposed to do. Alright, oh, was I supposed to kill Claudia? I think I probably was. Yeah, okay. Oh, how far back are you going to send me? Hopefully not too far. All right, need to do all this bit again. We'll be right back. All right, here we are. Okay, so killing Claudia is not the thing to do. 
right then. Oh, we're nearly there. Okay. So what do I do? No. God damn it. All right. Can I use... There's got to be something I can do with this thing. I can't use that here. I don't care about it right now. Oh, God, can you just go around? All right, nothing over here. There's something in here I can use. I don't know what to do. <sighs> All right, back again. And yes, I had to look it up. Apparently, I have to use the pendant I've been carrying. Well, there's your god. This? Looks like God didn't make it. Stop! God is... You are all kinds of messed up, girl. Lessa, you cannot kill God. I will... I will burn God. If you can't do it, Lessa, I will... You have weapons, kill her.
That ain't right. Alright. I'm guessing we have to go down here. This has to be the end game now, surely. It's this. Oh, hello. Well, Claudia's dead. Can't be dead. I was going to kill you. Yeah, this is going to be a bit of a sod. How far back are you going to send me? Because if you're going to send me back to the save, then this is going to be a, a not the end of the series just yet. No, it doesn't look like it. Okay. Okay, it looks like I have to wait for the creature to be... the floor because yeah
Okay. Down to the handgun. Damn it, I have no idea what I'm doing, but I'm going to have to call this an episode because I am woefully underprepared for this. So thank you for taking the, time, taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I've been Sigma later. This has been Silent Hill 3, and I'll catch you next time. Take care now.